guys, welcome back to the channel. We're outside the Hawthorns. Uh, we just thought we'd have a walk round. Liam's actually got himself the away top. Um, but we're just going to be doing like a quick player of the season. It's pretty hard to pick who actually has deserved it because there hasn't been that many like standout players and stuff like that. Um, you know, a lot of the players have only turned up in the last five games since Pardew has left. So it is actually going to be very hard to like say who we think player of the season is. Um, but I think out of three players, if it was for me, I'd probably say uh, Craig Dawson, um, Rondon and Chris Brunt. The reason I say that is because two of the all three of the players there, no matter what circumstances West Brom are in, they always put in a shift. They always try and give 100%. OK, we haven't been amazing at the back this season, but even when in those games where we haven't, you know, Dawson's, you know, come in with a few good goals. He's scored off a few set pieces and stuff like that. Uh, Rondon, he just works his socks off every match. I know a lot of people don't like him because he doesn't score like 50 goals, but if you look at it, he's in a poor team, ain't he? He's been in a poor team this season. He's still got like maybe t 10 plus goals, I think. He has, yeah, he's play, he's, he has played, he's, um, you can see it after the games and all. Like, Comes stayed, around the pitch, doesn't he? Yeah, he stays on the pitch and, you know, he's really giving his heart for the team this season. He's just, he just ain't worked out for us, has it? I mean, if, if it was me, I'd, I'd say uh, Ron Don is my player of the season um, or um, Ben Foster with the saves. You know? Yeah, I agree with Foster. He's kept us in some very important matches. Newcastle away this season, that save he made against Man United yeah. where... Uh, sorry, Tottenham where Harry Kane was thrown goal. And that Lukaku header against Man United. Didn't yeah, he's made some key saves, but he has been a bit wobbly at the start of the mm. season. But the reason I put Brunt in there as well is because he's another Rondon. You know, he, he, he puts in a shift every match day. You know, he's been at the club 11 years. He's a good captain, I think. Um, but I think Hagazi does deserve a bit of credit yeah, as well. Yeah, he's, he's really good header in you know, from the corners and that as well. I mean, He's come from like the Saudi Arabian League or whatever and he, he's, he's jumped straight into a Prem team and he's done a pretty solid mm. job. OK, we haven't been amazing this season, but like I said, there isn't that many players to pick from. But guys, let us know who you think your player of the season is. It's just a quick video. I'm going to try and get as many out as we can because <coughs> the season's ending. But Villa play later against Middlesbrough. I hope Middlesbrough win. Uh, it's going to be hard because... You know, Pulis, Middlesbrough manager, ex West Brom manager. If he goes up, then it's going to be a bit of a kick in the teeth. But then again, if Villa go up and Wolves go up and we stay in the Championship, it's going to be awful as well, ain't it? Well, it is to be honest, but I think Middlesbrough's going to win the game. Hopefully, we get a result. I mean, hopefully, you know, we get a result on Saturday as well against Palace. I think we will. That's for a different video anyway. We'll do a preview and whatever. But yeah, just let us know who you think your player of the season's been. It's going to be hard to pick from, but we're interested to see who you think. See you later, guys. 